Hi everyone, I'm actually here uh, and half alive to make a video. So I had a new cosplay arrive. It's one that I'm wearing for MCM Comic Con this year in May. Finding the cosplay was quite hard because they all looked kind of naff. Uh, but I found one that looks good. So I bought it because why wouldn't I? Anyway, it's a character that I love a lot. I actually main her when I play League. And it is Seraphine. Well, if you don't know who Seraphine is, she's hella cute. She's a pop star. She's part of KDA. If you don't know what KDA is, please go do some research. Because, whoa. So I thought I would do a test run of getting ready. Oh god, my nose. <sighs> nice. If you actually like this video, let me know. We're gonna start with the makeup. Look at this egghead, Dr. Eggman Slay. I look so ill. So, I'm gonna start with some foundation. Blend this in. I'm really looking forward to going to MCM. I've actually applied to perform. My day choice of Seraphine actually kind of depends on if I get a slot in the performance. And if I do, whatever day it is that I've been given, that'll be the day that I do Seraphine. Oh my god, I have such a big forehead. It takes me so long. Honestly, Gatwick Airport. I've only ever been to one Comic Con in my life. That was MCM last year in October. And I was Jinx. Exhibit A. I had a great time. I didn't go with a creator pass because I didn't know that they existed. So I paid to go and I met other creators there that I knew and they were like, where's your creator pass? I was like, who's that? Your girl applied this year, your girl got one. So I'm going to all three days. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in. This is actually like, this is, I, 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 um. I, 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 what? I eat you now. This, it's so dirty that I can't even read it anymore. I get sent loads of makeup from Revolution and I go through it so quickly. So Revolution, if you're watching this, please send me more, I love it. So this is like an eye primer, but I use it as concealer because I'm really pale. I'll whack a bit of that on and blend it out with my finger because then it's more the, pi the uh, pig? The pigmentation is better. I feel like this video is gonna be quite long, I talk so much. As I was saying, I'm really excited for this Comic Con because I feel like I understand them more. I didn't know that photographers were a thing there, or togs, as I've learned that they all call them. So I've cosplayed since like 2018 in my bedroom, but I've never done cosplay in public. But Jinx was like my first time. I literally traveled on the train, on the tube in central London for over an hour with this hair and this amount of clothing on. I got some strange looks arriving. I was so excited. I remember the first photographer that came up to me. I was standing with my friend who's done a load of comic cons. Her name's Kitty. Check out her account. It should be like here. It should be on the screen somewhere. So yeah, anyway, I'm standing there with her. She's dressed as Carrie Slay. We're talking and I'm like, this is so cool. Like my inner child would feel so healed right now. And then this photographer, who I don't know is a photographer, I just thought it was some random dude. Excuse me, can, can I take some pictures of you? Realises he's got like a professional camera. I freak out a little bit. And uh, I'm like, yeah, okay, sure. Uh, I'm looking at them like, what do I do? And the whole time I'm posing, I'm panicking that he's taking pictures. I really start freaking out that I have no money to give this guy. I have to pay him. I don't have any money. And then he gives me a card and I'm like, you're giving me things? He's like, yeah, it's my card. Like if you want the pictures, DM me and I'll edit them and send them to you. And I was like, I don't, I don't have any money. Like just delete them. You don't have to pay. Like I'm here for this. I was like, what? I was so confused. Less talking, more doing. Okay. Whoa. I've McFallen. Less talking, more doing. Some powder. Gonna just whoop. Yeah, so all day I was like trying to make the most of these pictures, but a lot of them didn't actually reply back to me. So I was a little bit sad because I only had about probably seven, six pictures of my whole first con. But hey, those pictures, they are special ones and I love them a lot. Again, revolution this isn't even an ad it's so cheap you don't have to use a lot of them because the pigments are so strong so it just lasts longer as well so i'm just gonna get some of this pink um <laughs> that is definitely a pink brow so i'm just gonna go ahead and do it on the other one okay so they're pinked up so again with my revolution palette i'm just taking the white and i'm gonna just pat it down i find that patting colors the pigment is so much better rather than <gasps> hiccup 
rather than brushing if you brush it kind of doesn't hang on as heavy whereas if you pat it just hits different so yeah postman pat postman pat postman pat and his black and white cat what was the black and white cat called I, I can just imagine people sitting behind their screen right now shouting the name of the cat Jess that's what it was called okay I got pasty eyes another revolution palette there's like this shimmery highlight one here whack some of that in the corner now it's time for the powder to come off So I'm going to be filming another video of one of my other MCM looks. So I can answer any of your questions in that video. Just got me Too Faced bronzer. I'm just going to put a tiny, 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 tiny bit. Drag it down a bit. I rarely use eyeliner. I actually have a secret. And my secret is face paint. Draw the cat eye sharp enough to kill a man. Look at me go. That's good. And then join it from here. Ta da! <laughs> okay, a little bit of nose contour. Yoink. Let me know in the comments who you think my other cosplayers are going to be. Let's see if you can get them right. And I blend. Brush. I'm going to curl my actual lashes. So everything actually has blue eyes. My blue contacts have gone for a walkies. So for today, we're using green, uh, but for the actual thing, I will be using blue. So if there's any contact companies that want to send me a pair of quite big blue contacts, please feel free. Ah, it's jumping around. This is like the only time I was quiet because of the amount of concentration. So I'm gonna let you enjoy that. Psycho. I'm gonna go back to my pink. So I'm just doing like a cute little under eye moment here. I wanna do the inner corner. I don't even know how to describe this shape. Not cat eye, but like a rounded off cat eye. Like the ego eyeliner. So I'm doing eyeliner underneath and then mascara. With my fingers, I like clump them clump. into little sections. Uh, look how pretty and clumpy. I'm going in with the pink and a bit of this red for a blush. Back at it again at the Revolution. I literally own blusher, but hey, this comes out nice. All that we have left is lipstick, but I'm gonna do my lipstick right towards the end because otherwise it will go a bit crusty. So now it's wig time. So I'm just gonna brush her out. So she's on. I look a bit crazy, but it's time to style. Now, I'm not great at styling wigs. I just know that this is gonna be cute. I have absolutely no idea what I'm saying here, but you know what, it's probably not relevant. So like and subscribe, follow my other socials, which are in the link description. Here is me faffing about with a wig, and then I'll whip out some liquid latex because I have no wig glue. Yeah. So here's me putting foundation on my lips. <coughs> so I have an even base and then I just take some pink and red eyeshadow, whack it in the middle of my lips. And then I have this lip stain that's really pretty. I bet you can't guess where that's from. Yep, it's from Revolution again. And then a whack on the blue star and that is the makeup done. Ah, let's get the costume on. <laughs> a cheeky sneak peek of one of my instagram pictures make sure you follow me or subscribe on youtube isn't it but make sure you follow me on my other socials which are in the link description below let me know what other cosplays you'd like to see make sure you leave some comments and questions ask me questions about mcm hopefully i'll see some of you guys there